We've organized human society around what we think of as normal weather. We've organized our agriculture, our cities, our transportation, our human habitat, pretty much everything around normal weather. And under normal weather, we have about one third, one in three years are a little bit colder than usual. One third are normal and one third are a little bit warmer than usual. In those circumstances, human society works perfectly. It's out on the edges where we get into real trouble and the edges are where we get incredible heat waves that kill crops, floods that inundate our cities, droughts that destroy agriculture. So let's look at the real world and see what climate change is doing to our weather patterns. As you can see, these data from NASA show that for many years, this is starting in the 1950s, actual weather patterns match the normal. But as time went by and climate change begins to have an impact, the whole range moves to the right. And so today, only one in 12 winters is colder than normal. Only Two in 12 years are normal, and eight in 12 years are now hotter than normal. One in 12 is extreme temperatures we've never seen. So we are moving into an era where the extreme becomes the norm and where people have to live with unbearable hot temperatures, extreme floods, and extreme droughts. It's Australia at 106 degrees as the average temperature across the entire continent. It's Colorado where they get an entire year's rain in three days. This is what extremes mean. And unfortunately, climate change is driving weather into the extreme zones. 